I've been getting a lot of questions about the Harley Davidson as well as the 1987 Monte Carlo SS. Now the Harley Davidson is doing good. I plan on doing some more mods to the bike over the winter. As far as the 1987 Monte Carlo SS, that car was sold. The good news is, is that I have another Monte Carlo SS and I did. Now, I did a video almost 18 months ago or something like that and i uh showed y'all this car right here we're looking at this other ss that dave got right now paul is looking at it thinking about getting it ss interior floor sticking the floor and all that um but i haven't decided what i want to do with this i think i just want to put new seat covers this you know and keep it original looking on the inside it needs a new dashboard the dashboard is cracked um, I don't know if y'all can see that because of the glare, but the dashboard is cracked, cracked, so I will be getting a new dashboard. But this is the new project, man. Um, it needs some body work. It's not really bad. The frame is solid. You have the, you know, typical Mighty SS um, holes, spots, but the doors are solid. And the one door does have a dent in it. The trunk... You know, if I can't, I don't mind replacing the trunk if I have to, but I may not have to replace the trunk. My body guy may be able to fix that. But at the end of the day, though, man, I mean, pretty clean as far as uh, rust goes. This is all surface, and it's the same thing as the gray one. If you go back to my other Monte Carlo video, you'll see the hood on that one did the same thing. What's major is this right here. So... I have my body guy get that together and it has a dent in the door right there we'll see if he wants me to get another door or can he straighten it out my only fear is it's a nice little ding right there so i have the weather strippings for the doors already i got a lot of stuff for monte carlos already y'all really got an idea what the car looks like let's talk about what we're gonna do to it now first and foremost i want to take the engine out of that right now Get it to the body shop and let my body man go to work. After that, then I would like to get it to the LS shop. It's a local LS shop here that can do everything that I need done to it. Definitely want to go with either the 6.0 or the 6.2. We'll talk about why later. After I'm done with that, then we'll get into the rim section. I don't know if I'm going to keep the original rally wheel that's on there and put leather tires on there because i like original look or will i put a 24 i'm not going any bigger than that and i know that i will have to notch the frame for the type or the style of rim i want regardless if it's a rucci a santi or a forgiato as far as the interior i'm gonna keep the interior original i am going to order new seat covers for the front and back we're going to redo all the interior in the inside but it's going to all be original and we're going to slap a new dash pad on top of that cracked dash that we got in there and i may upgrade the gauges but besides that i'm not doing anything modern inside of the car it's going to be all original it may be a little different than the original paint but we're going to go with that same thing that same color and put the stripe right back down the side of that ss and make that thing look real good set it off like how i do when i do cars so keep in contact stay tuned with this mike this Monte Carlo 1986 SS build that I'm doing is definitely going to be dope. As far as the Harley goes, I will be doing some more content on the Harley real soon. But I want to knock this Monte Carlo out first. And then after that, we'll get into the Harley Davidson. And I think I'm going to redo the F-150 as well. So we got a few car builds set up already that we're going to get into this year. So make sure y'all tap in. Shout out to the people who asked me to do this video for an update on these cars. Sorry, I did sell the 1987, which I think is the best year of the Monte Carlo SS. So I'm feeling some type of way about even selling that joint. But I think this 1986 Monte Carlo SS is going to make up for it, man. It's definitely on the top of my to-do list, man. But make sure you get in the comment section if you got any suggestions on anything that I should do with this car. Let me know, man. And feel free to follow me on Instagram and you can DM me over there too. And make sure y'all follow my other YouTube channel, Amadi The Ruler, where I cover all the latest 
hip-hop and entertainment news. Peace.